Hey guys, it's Kat here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you my top 5 female anime characters that you should cosplay because they are pretty easy and some of them are cheap. So first on my list is Gilda from The Promised Neverland. And the reason why I chose her is because her wig will be really easy, like you won't have to do any styling. I was going to do Emma, but I feel like the wig would require some styling as it's pretty spiky. Overall, Gilda is the best way to go because you really you really don't really need to buy anything from any like full-on cosplay. You just kind of need a green wig, glasses, uh, a white button-up, and a white skirt, and that's literally it. Plus, she's such a cute character, and The Promised Neverland is pretty popular, so a lot of people will interact with your cosplay. So, yeah. Next is Mukuro from Danganronpa. And I chose her because I feel like she'll be pretty easy. You just need a black wig, a white short sleeve button up, and a black skirt, and a little red ribbon. And that's all you need. It's pretty cheap. And um, she's such a cool character. She's Junko's sister. And if you never watched Danganronpa or have never played Danganronpa, you you really should. It's really she's really cool. Next is Runa from Kakaguri. Kakikuri. I don't really know how to pronounce pronounce it, but this is a lot of people's first cosplay. I know it's my friend's first cosplay. It's about like four people I know their first cosplay was Runa, which is kind of funny. I don't know. I just feel like she'd be really, really cute to cosplay. There's no styling needed for her wig. No styling. It's literally just, just straight with bangs. And yeah, you just kind of need, you don't even need the uniform if you don't want it. Because I, I never even wear the, I have the uniform, but I never really wear the uniform. I just wear a white button up, the kakiguri skirt, and um, the orange jacket. So, yeah, you can just get the jacket for like, and you don't even need the skirt, you can just wear a black skirt. Um, you can just buy the her canon jacket from Amazon for like $30. Next, I've never... Okay, I've never watched Future Diary, but I know a lot of my friends that have cosplayed Yuno. I think it's Yuno. Is it Yuno? I don't know. I don't know if that's how you say it. Yeah, she just looks really fun to cosplay, and I, I've seen her wig. You just need the canon outfit and the wig. I saw the wig for like $20 on Amazon. So yeah. Next is Shizuku from Hunter x Hunter. She is in the Phantom Troop. I don't- I've, I haven't watched Hunter x Hunter in a while. Um, she's- she looks really cute and she's easy to cosplay. You just need the wig, which I saw one that's like already styled like her on Amazon for like $15. Um, and a black turtleneck and like jeans or something. Doesn't really matter for the pants. And glasses. So she seems pretty easy to cosplay and she's such a cool character. She's super strong and I love her. I love her so much. I love the Phantom Troop, okay? And those are my five characters. I almost did ten there, but... Those are the characters, and have fun, gamers!